Good morning, good morning. We're going to come from John 15, 4 through 8. Live in me. Make your home in me just as I do in you. In the same way that a branch can't bear grapes by itself by only being joined to the vine, you can't bear fruit unless you are joined with me. I am the vine. You are the branches. When you're joined with me and I with you, the relation intimate and organic, the harvest is sure to be abundant. Separated, you can't produce a thing. Anyone who separates from me is dead wood, gathered up and thrown on the bonfire. But if you make yourselves at home with me and my words are at home in you, you can be sure that whatever you ask will be listened to and acted upon. This is how my father shows who he is. When you produce grapes, when you mature as my disciples. One thing these churches need to learn how to do is stop filling up seats and learn how to fill up disciples, make disciples and not fans. Secondly, what this means is how do you bear fruit? By making the words that you take from the from the, the word, what you read in the word, bring it alive in your life. You can't just be a seer or a doer or, or a, seer, a seer or a hearer of the word. You have to be a doer of the word too. You can't just say, I love everybody, but you don't prove it. You can't just say, oh, I do this with God and I do that of God or I believe in this of God, but you're doing nothing. Nothing in your life displays that you are on the side of Christ because you're still out there in the world in the world your actions speak louder than your words and it's through your actions that you will bear fruit